here we are off to the Goodwill and of course I'm going to stop right here at the at the rack up front. Let's see what they left us. Okay, those um, those up there are binoculars. I don't think I want those. What is this? Oh, that's Talbot's. Okay, that's kind of nice. I don't know if it's if it's fifteen dollars nice, but here we have a little Kate Spade wallet. Oh, this is like really clean. This looks really nice. This one looks like it was barely used. Oh, yeah, that's, even the wallet's 15. I think that might just be too much. Um, yeah, I do think that might be too much for that. So, we're gonna put that right there. That looks like an older one, but I think for 30, that's, that's a little bit much for that, for 30. I like it, but no, I think I'm gonna pass. All right, so let's go hit let's go hit our um, our regular racks and see what we can find because those aren't gonna help. So let's just go ahead and keep on going. We'll get a cart over here. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead. I did not drop that. <laughs> Hi, honey. Hi, sweetheart. How are you doing? Good. Good to see you. It's nice to see you too. I'm gonna go find treasure. Okay. All right, so here we are in the shoes. Oh, this place looks like it's been through a hurricane. Mm, what are these? Oh, these are kind of cute. Now, I am not familiar with this brand, but these are adorable. Okay, these are chocol chocolaticas. Hmm, I don't know. Let's put these, let's put them in the cart. We'll take a look. That's kind of an, an interesting one. What are these down here? Oh, these are a pair of the Clark's, um, the artisan ones. I'm not a huge fan. It's like a, an eggplant. Um, it's like an eggplant, um, patent, patent type of color, but I think I'm going to leave those. We do have some Clark sandals and some Asics. I think I looked at these last time I was here. Yeah, I did. Those Hocus Pocus. And we have some uh, lands in right there. Oh, these are pretty. Look at those. Those are pretty. Which ones are these? Nike Renew. Those are pretty clean, too. Other than, like, a rock or two in them. I think I'll, I'll, I'll grab those also. I'm going to toss those in a cart. I think I'm going to go start back here at the handbags. It's getting a little... Um, it's getting a little crowded. People are coming up behind me. So I think I'm gonna come over here and look. And I know Carl's in the store too. So if you see someone sneak up behind me and put stuff in the cart, that would just be Carl. That's kind of, I like the colors. I don't think, it doesn't feel very good though, but I do like the colors on that okay let's put this back up here got some liz claiborne oh well here this one right here is a fossil and if they didn't mark it up it's kind of cute i don't mind it let me look at the inside nope inside's not bad zippers and pulls zippers and pulls are pretty good yeah, that's, I think that one's okay. That's a fossil. So right there. Okay. So we did grab one. Oh, and see, look, I told you, if things magically show up in my cart, that would be Mr. Carl. He just, he just, um, he just put a bunch of Christmas puzzles in 
and oh they're oh they're pretty ones and they're all different they're 2.99 a piece so you know just to let you know that that just happened see when think when he's here things magically arrive and they just show up in my cart oh this is kind of cute this is kind of a a geometric pattern it, it is new but i don't think it's it's there's no labels or makers on it. There is a Michael Kors up here, but I'm questioning whether it is even a Michael Kors. That is pretty cheap looking. Um, it's clean. Oh, you know what? Well, okay. Uh, maybe, maybe it is legit then, okay. I didn't think it looked very good at first, but it has a little bit of a stain right there, but not much. Made in China. Well, okay, maybe we'll, maybe we'll put that one in too. They did not mark, they didn't, so there's a little spot on that, but I think I can get that off. Um, they didn't mark it up. It's not one of the more expensive ones, but who knows? So we'll put that in there. I do see some um, some interesting looking things that they put out. What is this? Don't know what that is. It's kind of a weird one. It's kind of a clasp. This caught my attention. I like the colors on it. This is made by Tiani. I would say it's Italian. I would also say it's leather. I like the colors on it. It's and it'll it'll clean up nicely. It, I mean, I can tell it's a little bit older, but the inside is great. And I know that leather will clean up really well. Oh, it's soft. It's soft too. So let's put that in the cart. We're gonna put that in the cart. And what about this one right here? This one almost looks like a Patricia Nash. Oh no, this is an Access. That's pretty, but um, Access isn't. Um, isn't usually going to be like a leather brand. So we'll just come back over here. Oh, and what? Oh, look at that. What is this? Oh, that's an Aldo. Oh, the bottoms are, the bottoms all torn up on that. Well, I feel like I glanced at some of this stuff. Oop, that's got some stains in it. Okay. I feel like I jumped over a few sections. But um, I didn't feel like I missed anything. What is this one? Oh, this is a sack bag. And they did. They marked it up. And, you know, that's just, that one's just not going to be worth it once they mark it up. So that would be this one right here. Um, and I can see some Kim Rogers and stuff down there. I do see a leopard, a, a print bag. Oops, as I'm, I'm pulling stuff down, it's falling off the walls. What is this one right here? Oh, that's an over the, that's kind of nice. That's a, um, a shoe rack. I don't have, I, it's funny cause I just, I just got done um, putting my closet together and um, you know, figuring out where to put all the shoes is, is a chore, but I'm happy with it. it. It turned out really nicely. Carl Carl helped me with it. It was nice to finally get it organized. Oh, is, is, is this what I think it is? Happy day, I think it is. Is that Tory Birch? I'm pretty sure it is, and it is. And they didn't mark it up. They didn't even see it. Oh, happy day, happy, happy day. Okay, there's my score, that, that's my score for today. I love it, I think it's great. Yeah, that was, that was definitely a score. Wait till Carl sees that, he's gonna fall over. Yep, that made my day, right there. Look at that, it's beautiful. And it was sitting here, nobody grabbed it. Well, that's what they said, you know, timing is everything. The more you, the more you go in and, you know, the luckier you get sometimes. What about this one? Who is this? This is kind of has a, an, oh, that's a Nine West. I like it, but it's, it's not going to be a high quality. 
What about this one down here? Let me find, what about this one? Oh, now see this little guy is a Brighton. Look how cute that is. Let me see if it's all together, if it's fall or if it's missing stuff. So they didn't mark this one either. This is a small one. They might even do this one for the four dollars because it's so small. But it looks it looks just, just a little little bit, which will come right off with a little um, shoe cleaner. So I think we will definitely put that in there. Well, let's come over here and look at the. Got some Ron John. Oh, what's that right there? Oh, okay, so we looked at this before. That's fossil, but that one's falling apart. What about down here? Nope, that's got somebody's name on it. Okay, so I have to look through the wallets. I am so excited about that Tory Burch purse. Carl's just gonna fall over when he sees that because he knows I'm such a purse, purse girl. You know, when the clothes don't fit and the shoes don't fit, the purse does. Yep, that's my philosophy. I'm gonna stick to it. That's a Liz Claiborne. I'd had, I could, it was kind of small. It took me a minute to figure out what it was. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, this is gorgeous. Oh, and the straps are inside. Oh no, look, the leather is completely coming apart. Oh, and it is leather too. That means somebody kept it in, an, in a hot area. This is a Monet, like the jewelry. Here's, I'm, I'm tempted to buy this just for the extra strap. Look at that, look at it, it's completely falling apart. You know what, let me check the strap. If, if she wants to, if she's gonna, they're gonna sell it, nope, see the strap is, oh my gosh, this thing has just been demolished. Oh, that's so sad. That was really pretty too. That's a shame. Yep, I definitely would have taken that, but it's it's just the leather is, is peeled off everywhere on it, so I, I can't I can't make that work. Um, okay, so let's go down here and see what else we can find. All right, let's go and um, let's go ahead and walk through. And come over here and look at shoes. Oh, these are really cute. These are LL Bean. And these are these are actually a size 10. I kind of love them though. I mean, they're very sweet. You know what? I think we'll put them in the cart. Okay. People are kind of giving me that look because I'm using I'm using the neck camera now. Oh, these are dansk. Nice. Two for $4.99. Okay. Yep, I think we'll take these and we'll have to check for those. Okay. Oh, look at this. Now, what are these down here? Oh yeah, I love those nurtures. Those are great. Yep, keeping those. We're taking those. These are really nice. Very cute. All right, so I'm gonna put that in the cart over there. Okay. So just adjusting and getting used to everything. I hope you guys are getting a good view. What are these? Oh, these are white mountains. Okay.
I think I saw these the other day, but they had marked them up. Yeah, they had marked these up to 15, so I, I did pass on those. They're, they're just too expensive at that price. Um, oh, hello, Salvador Ferragamo. Mr. Ferragamo. I have to figure out if that's going to clean up. It's kind of a, a, a like a nubuck leather. So that's got a little bit of a flaw. These, these are small. I mean, I'm talking like maybe a size five. I mean, they didn't, they did not mark them up. So I guess, I guess these would be kind of a, a no brainer. Um, Just have to get the rocks and stuff out i'm just like i said i was just worried about that one shoe having a little scuff on that but i probably could clean that up a little bit because it is actually leather you know what that's not bad i'm not even sure these aren't little kids shoes but when it comes to um italian shoes and this and that they're going to be very small Maybe something is missing on the top. I think something was I think something was cut off of these. Yeah, I'm going to put these back. I think something is cut cut off cuz look at that. It looks like something it looks like something is missing on them. Darn. Well, that was exciting, but yep, I think they're going to have to go back. What are these? Oh, these are soft. Those are pretty. These are kind of um, a brick red. It's They're not a brown. They're not a red. They're kind of like right in the middle. Um, I do kind of like them. Those are kind of nice. I'll put those in the cart too. Since, since sandals are starting to go, um, today was a good a good um a good purse day um so i've had um i did did um sell a couple of purses today and thank you thank you to my my viewers because i know a couple i know a couple of sales recently have been viewer sales um so i i really appreciate that sorry i was coming back to look at the belts again I something caught my eye and i turned around and then turned around again so sorry about that Things have things have changed a lot since I um, since I got the neck camera. So this is my second attempt with the neck camera. I really do like it. So hopefully, hopefully you guys like it too. I do have a busy Friday this week planned. Lots of sales this week. So um, who is this one? Oh, that's Sperry. I looked at those before. Those are so cute though. But I know they're not gonna, the, the Sperry's just, the Sperry's aren't gonna be great. So let's turn around and let's um, come back and look at the other way. Okay, so those are easy spirit, these are easy spirits. I probably should start buying easy spirits. I know, I know people really like them. Um, and they are here they would be $7.99 and these look almost brand new but I think I'm gonna pass on that I noticed that um, I'm trying to buy things that I know are gonna be going to be a better seller just because of space this one's missing something these are borns but it's missing it's missing a lace or something a tie or something okay so, oh, so here's some, are these Allegrias? Yeah, these are Allegrias, ooh, yep. The insides are really worn on those. I don't think I could even pull those off. So that's a shame, because I, I always like these type of shoes, but I am going to, the insides, as you can tell, they're pretty, pretty dark. So I'm gonna leave that there. I don't mind cleaning them. I just have to make sure that they're, they're gonna be, 
going to be worth the time to clean them. That's, that's what it is. Oh yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Okay. Oh, these are nice. Okay, here, I'm gonna pull one of these down so you guys can see. Look at these. These are Eddie Bauer waterproofs. Those are pretty nice. Oh, they did mark them up to $20 though. So I don't know if they're $20 nice, but we'll put them in and we'll check. I'm really trying to get away from buying the um, the expensive ones, but um, you know, sometimes it, sometimes it just is what it is. So we will go back here. I know Mr. Carl is back here somewhere. Look what I found. I have to show you. They, yeah. they didn't mark it up. Ooh, that's beautiful. I know. I'm so excited about Good. that. Good. Are you off? Yeah, just for lunch. I'll be back. Okay. Bye, honey. I am doing. what do we got here so we got some cute little NFL gear I can't see what's on the bottom so that looks like a oh, like a photo box what are, where are those these look like they're brand new socks but I don't know what they're probably the gold toe you know why I'm guessing that because they got gold toes <laughs> so and I did see I did see Miss Strawberry Shortcake here Oh, she's cute. I don't know if she's um, an older one or a newer one though. I'll have to check here. Let's see. Nope, she's a new one. So I think she can have, she can have to stay. Um, I did see the little heart socks. Those are really cute. The little socks with them on, but I think we're gonna leave those too. All right. Well, let's go ahead and head back here and These are cute. I like the um, the woven placemats for summer. Those are nice. Um, I grew up with something like, like this. My mom always had these and the little, do you guys remember the little baskets that the paper plates used to sit in? Yep, my mom had those too, so. Oh, look how cute. These are little primitive um, photo frames. We got a little, sh little uh, sheep and there's a piggy. Let me see. We have a sheep and a piggy and a chicken. And, oh, look at the little Tinkerbell. Oh, here's one of these little blue birds. Oh, the Tinkerbell frame is really cute. It's got some dirt on it though. Oh, that might be, a, one of the flowers might be broken on that. Let's put that one right back there. Um, I'm trying to see if this is signed. I know a lot of times these bluebirds um, can be collectible. There's a maker that makes them. I just can't remember off the top of my head who it is. I'll put it in the cart. Um, I did see the, um, oh, cats, rubber stamps, hmm, cats. I did see the acrylic church, the Cracker Barrel, but I think I'm gonna leave that behind for $6.99. But I think I will put this little guy, I'll put him in the cart. So now I'm wondering if there's gonna be more of the, the dance dishes now that we are, oh, look. So remember the, the ones we just saw, here's, here's the little teddy bear. Look how cute that is, he's on wheels. That's <laughs> cute. All right.
right, let's see what we have in these little boxes. Candles, candles. Got some weights. Okay. And see. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Let's go see if we find some more stuff down there. All right, what are these? Oh, these are Better Homes and Garment Garden, so that'd be like a, like a Walmart. Ooh, oops. As long as I don't break them. Okay, what about over here? These look, these look like the, um, yeah, I, I, I thought those were Gibson. I've seen this series before. It's kind of like a, like a Pilgrim series. Okay, so these are JCPenney's, okay. these right here oh these are Franciscan Franciscan does have some patterns um, that sell really well obviously the atomic pattern is the atomic pattern is the one you want to find with with the atomic symbols on it that's that's the good one and funny enough I've actually never run with all the thrifting and all the places I've been to I have never run into one in the wild I always find that odd because sooner or later you, I, I see things like, you know, I see pieces of things, but nope, I haven't seen that yet. But I will keep on looking because that is definitely something that I would want to pick up. Well... So I guess this is the red aisle now. It's not really Christmas. It's, it's kind of a, like a Valentine's type of thing. I did find, um, last week, I did find a few Fenton pieces, the cat pieces, which all of you saw me find. Um, I kind of think I'm at the point now where I'm going to have to go and sort through, sort through the cart and see um, what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to put away. Well, I did find, I did find some, some nice items. So that was, that was good. And here is, oh, look at this little guy. Oh, <laughs> it's the bobblehead kitty. Look at that. It's got a big old bobble. Now, see, I like these. They're hard to ship. Um, but this might be, it says, this one says made in India. The handle is really loose on that one. Um, there's a few, I have one of these and I have, I've never, I haven't listed it, I know bad, but it's from Anthropology and it's a big um, like charcuterie, like, you know, cutting board tray. So I, I probably should, I probably should, you know, get to that, but this is real pretty, but I'd be worried that those handles are loose and the tray is very heavy to have loose handles, so. Oh, we got some bunnies over here. Bunnies. That's cute. Oh, okay. So it's like a little bookshelf, like a little bookends. And you're taking this now? Okay. 
Let's go ahead and head out this way so that they can get their stuff. All right, we're gonna have to go this way because like I said, it's getting a little more crowded in here. What are these? Comfort Plus. Comfort Plus, okay. I've picked up this a few times. I'm still looking at the shoes for Cruz. I don't know, they always catch my eye. And I mean, these are some um, Gap sandals. Okay, let's go ahead and head over here to the corner so I can do my, my final inspection of the items and decide like what I'm gonna take and what I'm gonna leave behind. So I'm gonna turn you guys off and I will come back in a little while. Hi everyone, I wanted to do a quick recap of the things that I picked up at the Goodwill. Um, I did get a, a, a few pairs of shoes and some other things, so I'll start off with the puzzles. I did get six puzzles. Each one of these puzzles was $2.99 a piece. Um, so I did get six of those. Um, you know, they won't sell for much, but every one of them is brand new and sealed. We did get a, a DVD series, How I Met Your Mother, but honestly, that will probably stay with us because we'll watch that. Um, I did get an Eddie Bauer pair of women's hiking boots. I got a, um, I, I like this brand a lot. This is a Nurture, it's, it's a nice brand. Um, I did get a little Brighton um, crossbody bag. Um, this bag I just thought was so nice. It's made by Tiani. It looks like it's older. Um, it's Italian. The leather is really nice on that. So I did grab that. Um, I also did get a pair of these chocolaticas. I guess they're made by um, Hot Choc, the Hot Chocolate Company. They're just really cute. Um, and I know that brand does sell good. And my, of course, my favorite piece that I got was this Tory Burch purse. It was hiding in the purse. I paid $7.99 for it. And this will probably be the best find. Um, you know, that might just be the best find I've ever had at Goodwill, honestly. Um, this this purse, I do anticipate, will be probably in the $100 to $200 range. Um, it's in really great shape. It looks like it was never even used. Um, so that was a really, really nice find. Um, my total spent at the Goodwill was $86. Um, so not a bad, not a bad day. I did pay up for the Eddie Bauer boots, but, um, they were in really good condition. So I figured, you know what, I was just gonna, I was gonna do that. So, um, 80, $86 spent at the Goodwill today. And thank you so much for watching. Um, if you would like to visit the eBay store, you can find that in the description, um, section. And also, if you haven't already, please like and share. We really do appreciate it. And as usual, thank you so much for watching. Bye.